the blessings of the past. The blessings are yet to come, but in a very special way. We gather to celebrate in the presence the great love that we have for Brittany and Michael. The great love that they have for all of you. The great love that they share as they give each other to themselves today in the sacrament of marriage. The love that we share as family and friends today. There's one thing that I am sure of. There's one thing I think that everyone in this church is very sure of. That the two of you truly are doctors of the heart. Not just the heart of each other, but the heart that you share with everyone that you meet. I, Michael, take you, Brittany. To be my wife. To be my wife. I promise to be true to you. I promise to be true to you. In goodness and in health. In goodness and in health. In good times and in bad. In good times and in bad. I love you. I love you. And honor you. And honor you. All the days of my life. All the days of my life. I, Brittany, take you, Michael. I, Brittany, take you, Michael. To be my husband. To be my husband. I promise to be true to you. I promise to be true to you. In good times and in bad. In good times and in bad. In sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. I will love you. I will love you. And honor you. And honor you. All the days of my life. All the days of my life. <laughs> And Britt has always lived, at this point, kind of a charmed life. She's a, a fairy tale life. She's been a princess and a queen and kind of everything in between. And uh, I'm sure, I don't know Mike that well yet. I'm sure we'll get to know him better. But he looks like he could be a prince. And he's probably, he's probably had some, some charm in his life. I drove home and he was walking the dog, our family dog, up at the top of the hill and I was like, Psh, that's it, he's, he's sold, you know, and ever since then it's been, it's been great and you really are like a brother, I'm, I'm honestly so glad to officially welcome you to our family. I love those two beautiful smiles. I love the kindness and the compassion that you both share for each other and with all of us. And for that reason, you might not get the official title, but you truly are saints of our lives.